Hi guys, welcome to another episode of It Lurks Below. This is a game created by Mr. David Brafik and um, it is closed beta. So you may have seen it in Steam, but you can't really play it yet. But I got you cover, uh, showcasing to you some of the game feature, what is it like and so on. Uh, in many ways, you know, some of you may think that it is like this game or that game. Well, you know, um, you may be correct as well but I, I haven't really played those games so I don't really know but what I do know is that this game is very hard um, the uh, you know you may have remember I've got some characters here well guess what I have to delete them all because uh, I couldn't sustain my um, you know my character keeps starving so it seems to me that um, not only do I need to take care of the monsters and you know build a base and stuff like that I I need to take care of the food cycle as well. And that very much reminds me of Don't Starve. Uh, some of you may have played the game as well. And so here I am creating yet another character here, uh, brand new again. Um, so I play a little bit. And I, I'm going to showcase to you a little bit of the, um, you know, the stuff that I do because I thought it's rather interesting. Now I do keep some food around just in case I get like really hungry. Um, and also there are some berries as well. So now, uh, you know, these are all the wheat that I put in, um, it's kind of planted, and there's some carrot as well. So now um, I, I'm going to just show, showcase to you how it really works when it comes to food uh, management here. So I pick all my carrot here, these are all my carrot, and there's some carb cabbage as well. Uh, what I have found out, uh, let me just allow me to just pick up all the food I have. You see, I'm getting paranoid because once you get starved, <laughs> you kind of like uh, try not to get starved again. So I've got all this food here. Uh, the uh, gameplay is rather easy actually, uh, so, so the, the, the reality is that you try to chop trees that, you know, you can chop all the trees that you can, but uh, I believe it will grow just like don't starve, like just now the tree, it grows a little bit. So I, I presume don't chop things that you are not needing to, uh, that is one thing that I've learned. Uh, just let it grow a little bit, um, you know, not just chop everything that you see here, but that they do have some trees here that may kind of get in the way, but whatever. Um, so now the... The, I think the correct way to play this game, uh, let me see, um, uh, I've mixed some kind of like a cooked vegetable. So if I eat it, it actually gives you more nutrition than, um, and it will preserve on its own, I think. Well, hang on, they have expired there as well. So what I usually do is that uh, I leave some food around while I try to uh, try to make them into seeds. So I could extract them into seeds, like for example, let me just get 10 of them. And uh, you see what I mean, every pack of 10 will give me like 27 or whatever. Uh, I think there's some randomness to it. And I could like uh, 28. So the, you know, what I could do is to continue to extract them into like seeds and so on. And I could plant them as well. So, uh, so I could, well, I need to sort of like, uh, you know, make the ground suitable for planting and the, uh, you know, it's a bit of work here, but it's about building your base and making sure that you are not starved to death <laughs> when the time comes. So, ooh, hang on. Yeah, I, I wish that there's an easier way for me to sort of like do all these things. Um, maybe there is. Maybe I'm just not aware of how. The uh, So I need to get all these things here. Um, you know, you have the target a little bit lower, like, you know, to the ground itself. Yeah. So once you get it all sorted here, which is in a bit, and uh, I think I'm getting hang of it. Um, yeah. And uh, by the way, those are the weeds. Uh. Okay. And uh, let me continue to do my ground first here, um, so I can start planting. And uh, it's important to keep the keep the keep the thing going. So I've got a lot of things, and I've got a lot of seeds as well. So I just need to plant everything here. I could actually keep planting, and uh, there must be a better way. Uh, hang on a sec. Okay. All right. So there are all my all my all my uh, carrot. I can I can uh, get a cabbage as well. I think you know if you really bother, you could uh, do quite a good job in uh, getting a good foundation, multi level and stuff like that. I think now I'm just like experimenting what I could do. Ooh. Ah. All right, level up. <laughs> I dodge a bullet. See that? Um, so now I need to sort of get to, to some uh, get some ground as well. 
and the okay so here is the one that I could also plant something here yeah I uh, have to take a look at the uh, seed as well because I could extract them why not I just extract them I don't know whether these guys will destroy my like uh, food supply or not I have no idea really maybe they do eat my food <laughs> that would be rather unfortunate and rather unhappy uh, so okay that's cool and yeah I have more food and yeah I can plant some kind of like barrier so barriers uh, is kind of nice it just take up quite a fair bit of uh, places uh, that's about it um, all right so I the uh, I've got more seeds here maybe I just plant them all uh, in the spirit of uh, planting things I can cook something for you guys as well just to let you guys see how it looks like okay hang on a sec All right, so that is all the seeds I have. It's a bit dark right now. Can't really see. Yeah, I think the weeds are ready. Uh, so I can just get all the weeds out, and yeah, I mean it just. Ooh. Well, I can't miss quite a fair bit. You can press R to uh, to recharge anytime, just like any like a first person shoot kind of thing. Hmm, quite hectic, huh? So now I think um, Alright, so uh, then I can plant some seed here as well. Yep, so you get a drill and the, um, I need to cook something as well. I'm getting hungry. Okay, I'm getting hungry. So I'm going to eat something first. Alright, uh, so I've got quite a fair thing, bit of thing going on. Uh, try not to get the thing in the rotten as well because once it's rotten, I can't really do anything to them. Let me just extract them to see it. I'm not eating all this. And the, uh, I don't really need a lot of carrot as well. Let me just get all 10 of them and all 10 of them. Uh -huh. Now, I have a rather good supply of food right now. I'm not quite worried about food, at least for a while, because my unless there's something really bad happened to my farm here, which I'm pretty sure it will, because this game is just, just so, so hard. <laughs> uh, yeah, but, uh, you know, well, we'll see how it goes. There are so many things coming on to me. Come on, man. So, uh, what will happen if you if you kind of like um die, right? You, I think you just uh, you know you respawn again. But then sometimes it just got stuck. You can't go anywhere uh, because you just keep dying. So, um, like like for me, like when you run out of food it's really run out of food there's nothing else you can do about it so yeah um all right just let me just get some ground going and the uh you know a little bit different showing you guys i think last video i talked about how to you know uh kill things and how to um you know make your make your character stronger uh by crafting and so on i think this video is more about just oh there's a carrot here as well all right all right. Uh, let me see. Uh, anything rotting yet? All right. So now, uh, how do I cook? I don't. I can't remember whether I've shown you guys how I cook or not. But hang on a sec. Uh, to to cook it, I need to place a campfire. Um, no, I can't put it anywhere here, can I? Because of the uh, the fact that I. Ah. Uh, ah. Now all these things here means that I can't dig it. I can't like you know plant anything here. It's like a barren ground, so it's not really that great. Um, let me just plant plant all these things first while I want to keep talking. And the uh, and uh, I think all the wheat will come here. <laughs> a bit, uh, it's just the control a little bit clunky right now. It's just close beta, so I definitely feedback to uh, Mr. Private on this one, like how to make it easier to plant anything. Um, like oh okay, and the uh, wow, it's like a non-stop action man. Alright. Recharge. Ooh, I got hit. Well, I better sleep now. And yeah, I would like to show you. Ooh, wow, this guy is. 
great stuff and the uh i, I think i better Ooh, what is this the inspiring Ooh, i don't know what is it man i've got some reward um ancient item place in your main bar use them like instant item rank them up by spending gold or whatnot oh, okay very good i got ancient item i haven't seen that before i have no idea how it, how it go about it seems like a uh, kind of like random stuff which i kind of like because you know um sometimes yeah i found that every game i play is kind of different <laughs> but just so far i mean oh, see all the carrots are, are there so wow you see my food is sorted man look at look at all this food here i'm a super happy man all right so let me just uh cook something first okay i can i can put something here and i can start cooking and the uh so what i can cook is i got some carrot and some whatnot so i'm going to um let me see what i can do and the, uh, try not to overcook the whole thing because Okay, let me see. Uh, maybe I'll just one, two, three, four, maybe. Yeah, four of them. And the rest rest of it, I can probably turn in the seats, uh, like, you know, if I continue doing this whole thing. So, and the uh, shift right button. No, right. Okay, let me take it back. So now I, I could actually, you know, harvest all these things right now or just leave it there and after that i could uh, continue to do some seeding and stuff like that or maybe you know it come upon a time whereby i've actually got enough uh farms here so you know i i could actually uh you know start doing the stuff that i need to do uh start working on my on my like you know quest you see the trees are getting bigger <clears throat> and i think these are spreading as well uh, if i'm not wrong so you know uh, i think eventually there will be like no no place to Oh, I need to sleep. Uh, eventually, I think the whole service will be covered with all this like uh, land, and I have to dig it deep here to uh, to create my farms in multi level. So I I'm planning to do that, but I haven't really got a chance to figure out how to do it yet. And I'm going to eat right now because otherwise my character will die, and uh, all these things are growing right now. So it's kind of nice. So this video is not about violence or you know uh, taking down monster. It's really about how to go about having a sustainable food chain because that's just part of the game. Uh, if you run out of food, ah, this guy grows so big, yay! If you run out of food, you know uh, that that is it. Uh, that that is the the problem that you will get. And also try not to consume too much resources uh, unless you really need to build something because all this tree takes time to grow. And if you chop it like the like the berry, once you once you chop it into wood you lost it forever i mean you know and, and you have to find seats to do it all right so i hope uh give you another aspect of the game uh you know and, and my goodness this game is kind of very fun uh every game i approach is different i'm pretty sure something will sort of like make us make a game stopper somewhere and i have to redo the game again but that's fine it's just part of fun and um I'm, yeah another thing is that there is no reload kind of uh, option um so not sure whether you are aware of it is that you you, you can't really reload um the the game so the, what it really means is that I think every time you save the game, it go into the server somewhere because I can't even find it uh, in my in my local drive. I thought I can do a manual backup, like you know, before I do anything stupid, I kind of like you know, um, I can restore it back. But I can't, so I have to build, rebuild from the beginning again. But I say it's a journey. Every time I approach it, I'm uh, I'm learning something new. Every time it's a new experience so far. So I hope uh, you enjoy this series, and I'll probably do more of this game uh, once I get around to it. All right, see you next time. Goodbye.